Hey guys, welcome back to another video. It has been quite a while since I last made a video. It's been about two weeks. Sorry for that, but I had to take a little bit of a break because I was lacking ideas for videos. But for today's video, we are doing a 10,000 calorie challenge. And to start off the day, it is about 10.30. Um, we are going to have an English breakfast, which has two eggs, baked beans, and avocado toast. So let's get into it. Uh, after I finish my breakfast, I'll give you guys a bit more of a rundown on the video. All right guys, I've now finished my breakfast and I've also gone ahead and made myself a morning like shake, which is just here. Um, it has got like banana, oats and everything in it. So, so far it's been a very healthy start to, or relatively healthy, healthy start to this 10,000 calorie challenge. But I can assure you that it is not gonna stay that way because once I start getting desperate to get those calories in, I'm gonna have to go to a couple like fast food places, I guess. All up for breakfast this morning period, I've had a 1,552 calories out of 10,000 so far. So we are on the road. But it is now about 11.30, almost lunchtime. And I did have a very late start to this. Usually I've been watching these 10,000 calorie challenge videos. I've watched a few and they end up, they always start at like 7 a.m. and start really early, but well, I've made this challenge a lot harder for, my, for myself by starting at 10.30 or so. Anyway, um, I still think I can do it. I've been bulking for ages, so I am used to eating a lot of food, but not 10,000 calories. Like I said, it is almost lunchtime, and I think I'm gonna go out and have Subway, which is relatively healthy. I'm gonna go do that in about 30 minutes, so I'll see you guys when I'm heading to Subway. All right, I'm now here at Subway. It is about 1.30. I waited a bit to let the breakfast settle down because I don't actually realize how hard it is to actually eat that much for breakfast. I usually eat almost that much, but yeah, it takes a while for it to settle down and get ready to eat something else. So I'm now here at Subway. I'm about to go in and get something and I'll see you guys when I get out. All right, I'm now out of Subway. And I asked for, so I got a whole meal foot long with chicken, chicken schnitzel and I asked for heaps of salads and I asked for lettuce and she put, no, oh no, she did put, for some reason she put on jalapenos. <laughs> I don't know why. I don't know what I, I asked for carrot and she put jalapenos on. I couldn't be bothered correcting her in there so I just went with it and I also got a choc cookie to add to the calories so I'm just gonna eat it here do a bit of a time-lapse and yeah I'll, after that I'm gonna head home and I'll see you guys back there I just realized sorry whilst editing the video that I did not film when I got home but after this subway we got to 2779 calories out of 10,000 but once I did get home I literally was just lying down all the time to just let the food settle down and yeah I didn't actually have much energy to do anything to be honest but the next bit of footage is when I went off to go get some more food um, a couple hours later so let's get into that all right guys I've now arrived on my bike to the surprise place where I'm gonna have more food at it is McDonald's so yeah I haven't had McDonald's for ages but it wouldn't be a 10,000 calorie challenge without McDonald's so without further ado I'm gonna go inside I'm, we're running out of time really because it's 4, 4, 4 45, something like that um, and I really need to get inside order stuff and I'll bring it out and I'll show you guys when I get out so let's get into that feed acquired all right so here we are I found a little spot with my McDonald's ish. This is literally the first time I've had McDonald's in like eight, almost a year. So here we go. This is what I got. I just looked up the most calorie dense food they've got. So first off, we got a double quarter pounder fat. <laughs> then two 10 piece chicken nuggets. So 20 chicken McNuggets and a strawberry medium thick shake. So Without further ado, um, I'm going to set up the camera and do a little bit of time lapse. So, let's get eating. All right, guys, I'm now finished my food. Holy do it! 
I am ridiculously full right now. It is actually sickening. Ah, uh, God. So that full meal just there was 2,072 calories, bringing us to a grand total so far of 4,851 calories. So we're basically halfway and it is now five o'clock, which is a bit of an issue because it is past halfway in the day and we are only at halfway now. Just remember, I did start the day off quite late at like 10.30 a.m. with breakfast. So I still think we can do this and I'm hoping for a a healthier remainder of the day but other than that I need to get back home I'm gonna ride my bike home burn some of this off and um, I'll see you guys back when I feel like eating something again <laughs> right it's now six o'clock and I've been home for about 45 minutes and I'm actually not quite hungry right now but I know I've got to eat something and I also do want to do a workout so I'm gonna have a bit of a pre-workout meal what's this lighting man by the way I'm not gonna actually record my workout because these past videos, my past workout videos have actually just been quite repetitive I think and I thought this time I'd leave it out because a lot of 10,000 calorie challenge videos are just focusing on eating food and like completing the challenge. So that's what this video is going to be. So without further ado, I'm going to make a little pre-workout meal. So let's get into that and it is going to be pesto pasta which is quite calorie dense. So let's get into it. What an absolute mess. All right guys, I have now finished making my pesto pasta. Here it is. So it's just, it's just pesto pasta with parmesan on top. I'm gonna have to go eat all this even though I don't really feel like it at all. And then after that, I'm gonna do a workout. So whilst I'll be eating this pesto pasta, I'll be actually on my laptop over here, uploading a reel to my YouTube channel um, about my one year transformation that I, Earlier posted on TikTok, but I'm going to post it to YouTube as well. It is now 6.30, I need to eat this, upload that video to YouTube, and also do a workout, so let's get into it. One workout later, uh, it was now 8 o'clock and we had dinner with some friends. It was lamb, potato, and beans, and then we had some dessert and then I also had a protein cookie as a snack and then it was 10.30 at when I went to Coles after dinner for to, to get some midnight snacks I guess and so I got those things that you saw and then this pizza and at this point I really just could not be bothered talking to the camera I just needed to focus on eating and also as you can see here uh, there's two midnight snacks and then um, Xbox and so it was 11 o'clock I was just eating playing Xbox talking to my friends and just I was just not having it it was like as you can see on the plate I almost finished it all but I just couldn't stuff it down uh, yeah but that that was the end of the day and I filmed an outro at 1130 all right it is now 1130 and it is the end of the day I cannot eat any more food um, but I do have the total, grand total amount of calories that I ate today. And I ate 9,111 calories. So I was 900 off. So I did fail the challenge. Seriously, I don't know how people would finish that. Like, I was... Like, I had to stop eating right just before when I was eating that um, pizza pockets or something. Like, that was just not what I wanted to be eating. And I was so full. It was ridiculous. So, props to everyone that can actually do that. Uh, I was so close and it's so annoying that I didn't get there. But, anyway. I do hope you guys did enjoy this video. This one was a painful one for me. But, i got to get some sleep. So, I will end this video now. See you later. Thank <laughs> you.